there, I am Hari Krishnan and in this video we will take a look at few of the images taken by Chandrayaan 3 on August 19. The first one is Mare Humboldtia, often referred to as the Sea of Alexander von Humboldt. This lunar mare is nestled just to the east of Mare Frigoris, which is another dark flat area on the moon's surface. The term mare is Latin for sea. Although these areas are actually not bodies of water, they are large flat regions formed by ancient volcanic activity. Basin material dates back to the Nectarine Age, an era in moon's history, while mare material is the Upper Imbrian Epoch, which occurred around 3.4 to 3.7 billion years ago. The rim we mentioned is the raised edge of the basin. This forms a mountain range-like structure. A mass coin is a gravitational anomaly or concentration of mass beneath the surface, causing variation in the gravitational field. Interestingly, Mary Humboldtiana bridges the gap between the near and far sides of the moon. Johann Madler named it after Alexander von Humboldt, a prominent explorer of unknown lands. It's one of the two lunar Maria named after people, other being Mary Smriti. The circle on the moon is where Mary Humboldtianum is located. Now let's turn our attention to the remarkable Bos L crater. It's located at the red circle on moon. We encounter an impact crater that traces the northeast rim of moon's near side. The rim is the raised edge of the crater, and the near side is the side of the moon that faces the earth. Its side view perspective is a result of its location, and liberation effects can impact its visibility when viewed from Earth. Unlike many craters, Bos L has retained its well defined outer rim a testament to its limited erosion. The interior features a wide terraced wall and a slightly north of set central peak. It shares its lunar neighborhood with craters like Vashakide and Rayman, each adding to moon's diverse landscape. This is another crater called Belkovich, a walled plain located along the northeastern limb of the moon. The walled plain is a type of impact crater that has a relatively flat floor and a wide rim. This formation has entered a history of impacts, leading to its reshaped, softened features. It's often a challenge to view Belkovich in detail from Earth due to its side view perspective. Belkovich intersects with the Mary Humboldtianum and boasts a hilly, irregular surface outside its rim and the satellite crater Belkovich K lies on the northeastern rim. The outer rim, once circular, has been shaped into a range of mountains and hills. This is where the crater is located on the moon. Now, th this crater is called Hain. It's located at this red circle. Its unique location sometimes hides its western inner side from Earth's view while liberation can further challenge observations. Hain lies across the northwestern rim of the walled plain Belkovich and the neighbors the Mare Humboldtian. This youthful crater retains its circular, uneven rim and boasts a relatively flat interior floor. The presence of ridges, valleys, and peaks in India adds to its geological interior. As we conclude our exploration of these lunar wonders, we unfold the stories behind Mare Humboldtiana, Belkovich Crater, Bos L, and Hien Crater. These features remind us of Moon's rich history as well as the ongoing scientific discoveries being made through the space exploration. Let's hope for Chandrayaan's successful landing as well as uncovering great mysteries of the Moon. Stay curious and keep exploring the mysteries of our universe. Like, share and subscribe for more such videos.